in the market pullbacks this is when we fill our bags so in today's video we're going to be talking about some ai low cap gems like and subscribe v life had never been pretty couldn't even put it in a frame by any means had to get it but always kept my hands clean making moves across the nation every dollar made a dream building profit from creation any thought could be a thing how could they take it if they never gave it if i'm an enslaved then it's me that's gonna make it i feel like i'm at for better too because we all deserve it for special don't let no one tell you all right so you know how i'm coming man ai narrative rwa memes layer twos gamings and some of those narratives all can fall into the d pin narrative as well so i just want to let y'all know i'm into my d pin cryptocurrencies but we did see a kind of a correction throughout the market cap so i thought today was a good day to do some some ai low cap gems that i've been specifically looking at now full transparency they're low cap gems, so they are high risk. So always remember, never invest what you are afraid to lose. Do your research, do your due diligence. Make sure these projects may be for you. Don't just go aimlessly buy cryptocurrencies that YouTubers talk about. Not even me, Crypto Millie, all right? So we're gonna be talking about some AI gems, all right? Let's 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 get into it, because I know, I know y'all like these videos, all right? Y'all like these type of videos, right? Favorite narratives, AI. We're gonna be talking about the AI gems. All right, so first project we're gonna talk about is a GPU bot, all right? If we swing over to the max chart, looks good, right? This project has been around since March 1st, 2024. The FDV is about $3 million, right? I mean, when you think about Node AI and how high that market cap was able to hit, you got to think about these GPU projects that's actually legit, all right? Now, this is the thing, right? Some of these joints are fake. They copy and paste white papers, et cetera, et cetera. And even I, I went into an AMA of, of this project, right? And heard, heard the founders and the team talk about this project. And I told you this a couple live streams ago. It's extremely expensive to to host right a whole bunch of gpu cpu power right to lend out right this is not an easy feat so when you see projects out there saying hey you know we're the next opsec we're the next ghx it, this takes a lot of overhead right a lot of ai stuff takes overhead right so just make sure you do due diligence right? these are low caps right if, the, if these guys execute this does have the potential but they have to execute sitting here at a 2.9 million dollar market cap um Right over a thousand holders. The AMA, I listened to it. The, the guy seemed like you know down to earth guy. Hey, he, he said, hey, this is what we can do. This is what we can't, and I respect it, right? And I think that if this project can get adopted, right? If they execute and they do all the things that they aim to do, right? Decentralized infrastructure with blockchain power and AI enabled node services. Maybe this thing can explode and hit to the one hundreds and millions of market cap. Guys, always go check out the AMAs and see what the, the founders and the team is actually talking about. I think that's a good way to, to, to check to see if a project is for you. But these are low-cap gems because th these are going to be higher risk but could be higher rewarding, all right? So don't just, just aimlessly jump in. All right, so they rent GPU and nodes through Telegram, right? We know that there's been an influx of Telegram utilities as of late. This is one, and um, increased productivity through AI-enabled services. So you can utilize their Telegram to rent out CPU or GPU power. You can also lend it out and be compensated through their reward system, making this project a D-pin project. Now, why has it caught my attention? Right, I've been seeing tons of people talk about this in my live streams. They even have a way that they generate revenue, right? So I love projects that generate revenue. The one thing we look for when looking for a 100x project, and I hate to like bring this up while I'm kind of like doing this, but let's just go ahead and look at this and find our 100x graph i should have already had this pointed out but uh, again bear with me right the one thing i like to look for right this is like the ultimate recipe for a 100x project right um demand hype adoption real real use case team and tokenomics right so you can look at this graph if you got to copy this graph whatever screenshot it do what you got to do right this is some of the things i look for to you know you know say a project could potential 100x now um i seen the demand and hype tokenomics pretty good team don't know much about the team, but they seem like they are working to be transparent. Real world use case, we know that um, CPU power is going to be something that's that's needed with the hype around AI and the um, the growth of AI, and of course the adoption, right? So if people start um, utilizing this this platform to earn and even um, rent gpu or cpu power to build out ai platforms you can see the demand for this project actually 
pick up, right? And they even have um, burns, right? So they return the value to the holders through through burns, 5% um, buy and sell tax. And um, maybe they do something like uh, use the tax to buy back the project and then burn it. I think they did mention something about that. So, again, they do have these uh, these tiers, right? These subscription tiers where they earn revenue from it. That's what you want to see. Um, I'm not going to get to the technical side of this, right? This is something that you'll just have to do your research on. Um, NVIDIA, AMD, Intel. I don't get too hyped about these partnerships because they're not that hard to get, but it's good. Good look, right? Good look from a marketing standpoint. And you know, we like to go and see what people are talking about with GPU. And again, a lot of people are comparing this to GPU, um, which is Node AI, which is sitting around a $200 million market cap at its highs. GPU is $3 million. So this thing is, you know, uh, definitely has the p potential, if you think about where this could go, to 100x. They also are already making 20k a month in revenue from their platform so that's good that this this people are using it right people are going to telegram they're uh they're uh buying this this gpu and cpu power to build out ai platforms or they're lending out their gpu and cpu um cpu power to be able to um be compensated right which makes it deep in so the the deep in aspect is on the way as you can see in a week they will create the browser extension to lend out gpu so if you ever use gamer coin ghx it's very very simple you lend out your idle time of your computer and you get compensated in tokens right we're seeing this from a plethora of different tokens i think a tour is a, another big deep in project where they're using like utilizing excuse me this ecosystem to compensate people um for privacy so i like what i'm seeing from gpu this has potential but i want to make it clear guys this is also high risk all right so always go do your research um again if, if you want the low caps on on the youtube channel guys you got to go out there and do your research you can't just aimlessly buy these projects all right next project i want to talk about is zero ai now i really like this one right six million dollar market cap right I, I and i love playing around with ai too so if you don't know i'm a big fan of artificial intelligence right i'm like an ai maxi right now right we even have a community project consider checking it out you know, i'm not gonna shill it too much but continue. it is an ai meme coin right so so consider checking that out but zero x ai i like what i'm seeing okay i even created a little zone here i'm looking to find some entry points as it does put in this flag looking good on the daily bounced off the 618 as you can see from these wick candles so the project is strong 5.58 million dollar market cap 100 million supply only 2,000 holders and you think about projects with 100 million supply then you can absolutely see the potential now if you ever use vigo ai you know that these um video um prompt to video ais are about to be huge this is some of the stuff that they're already um uh, uh rolling out there utilizing the ai technology so you can swing over to telegram it's us again another tg bot right and a lot of people have been hard on these projects because they're like ah it's getting it's getting so saturated everybody wants to bring their utility to telegram so telegram utility where you um start the bot and you kind of like um you do prompts and it'll create a cool little video for you the only thing about it is i tried to do it on a private level i guess they wanted me to join <laughs> join the community and i didn't want to kind of like join the community because then they'll see oh crypto billy oh or johnny five ai he's, he's, what are they doing hanging around here right so um also i'm on on telegram and i'm also to always talking to other projects looking for integration and partnerships right so again um i like what i see here from zero ai right this looks neat man and they, they they actually make some very very good videos i tried to use the tech in telegram but i have to actually join the group right and i didn't want them to see it was me joining the group so i decided not to use it i just wanted to use it without joining the group but you got to join the group right and i believe this stuff is actually live don't quote me all right so i haven't tried it myself personally but i did go to the telegram and try it in the message you know and basically in the private message it wouldn't allow me to do it so i'm guessing i have to go to the official tg group anybody from zero ai feel free to comment in the um, comments and kind of like you know l let the community know how we can actually utilize this but you can see some of the things that their tech is actually allowing and um i think video prompt is the future um, that little Yachty video was crazy, and um, I don't think uh, Ziggo even has a, a a a token, right? But Zero AI does, and you can all also you know swing to the Telegram and start this stuff out, um, start using this stuff for yourself. So um, this is what they do, right? Prompt to AI, a new era in text to video and voice to video using ARBML mode, right? So then they're constantly getting integrations and partnerships. Zero AI, we hollered at you. 
trying to get that partnership with J5. Please, please respond. All right, so you can see some of the cool little videos that Zero AI is making, man. This is this is going to be, I mean, AI guys. Come on, look, look, look at this. This is this is that is that is insane. Like Samurai War. What? And then you got the uh. Uh, I actually don't want to have the I don't want to Alright there we go You can see the, the you know alien invasion Right there so um, This is some neat stuff this is some neat stuff And it looks clean it looks clean so guys let me know what y'all think about um, Zero AI They do have a revenue sharing Program right so it says earn endlessly With Zero AI our flagship Model Zero AI 2.0 competes Head to head with open AI Soar once released, our model will open doors for other projects to utilize API key. We are going to distribute 80% of the revenue generated from API key sales. Our AI will soon transition to exclusive access for premium users. With OpenAI's monthly earnings reaching 50 million, we're strategically positioning ourselves to seize the text-to-video market using our innovative utility while also rewarding our loyal holders. So, love what I'm seeing here from, from Zero AI. Again... A lot of this stuff is high risk, right? All of these projects can go to zero because they do have low market caps, guys. So, again, if the team is not docs, you are taking a chance, right? Um, if the team is not constantly putting themselves out there, even if you're not docs as a team, you can also put yourself out there by doing AMAs, right? So people can hear your voice. People can see that you're active. People can know what you're actually building and working to execute as far as expansion in the long term um, point of view for any of these projects. So, LP is locked, $5.5 million market cap. Um, when you think about how huge open AI and Sora AI is going to be, um, you can only imagine if Zero AI and their team is, is able to, you know, pick up on some of that liquidity for the AR market, this thing could actually absolutely send. So for that, I do have it on my watch list. All right. So I just want to make that clear, guys. All right. I'm not aping. I'm finding my, my, my points that I, you know, my entry points that I feel comfortable in and I'm letting the market come to me opposed to just aimlessly aping. So I will continue research on these projects even after this video. Next project I want to talk about is a Neuro AI. Now, I like this one because I like the gaming narrative. And this is an infusion between gaming, deep in, and AI. Sitting at a $10 million market cap, I think this thing is severely undervalued um, based on the narrative and the niche if they execute right if they execute one m in liquidity that's locked that gives me confidence right very 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 liquid putting in a nice good flag pattern here but again this thing has pumped so i want to make sure that it comes down a little bit before i look for these entry points as the stock rsi is looking to to reset but still 10 million dollar market cap for this type of project in my opinion is a very 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 good right it's like a steal right so you can use ai and prompts from AI to create 3D game assets for the marketplace. So if you have a game and you want to create assets for your game, you can swing over here and utilize their AI technology and create those assets through using prompts, right? Producing 3D content has been traditionally expensive and complex. Not anymore. Neural AI leverages generative AI to make textual descriptions into detailed 3D models, reducing costs and complexity. Quickly produce 3D models from text to prompts are intuitive Interface to craft 3D assets with ease. Enter your description and our AI model will, will materialize it into a 3D model. So um, this was an example. Create a slick bulletproof shoe for my cyberpunk game. And you can see here what it, what it created. You know, so again, this is the future of gaming, right? In-game assets, um, decentralization, um, directly import your newer AI, generate 3D assets in a game engine such as Unreal Engine. You can see these are some of the compatible um, modeling suites that they're already compatible sketch blender right 3.js and also unreal here so that's pretty sick that's pretty sick but wait there's more you can see here we got information on, on the team right they did a nice little thread about the team and um, why you should take a you know a flyer on the team right because they have experience with LM, LMMs that's such a tongue twister customized comfy UI and more um, you can see it says we've trained all type of models and Loras for SAAS companies and independent developers. So these guys have been around ML and M AI are complex subjects, especially when it comes to fine tuning, stable diffusion models and LLM models to simply awesome on the 3d side. We 
are competitive even compared to Web3 standards. And as for Web3, we certainly have an edge. Um, tell you a little bit more about the CEO experience. 10 years of software dev and business ventures, been part of multiple startups, a coder in languages C, Node.js, Python, JavaScript, and of course, Solidity, crypto and DGen investor since 2017. All right. And you can go through this tweet and check out more about the team yourself. And as I said, man, just because you create a project doesn't mean you're dev. That's why I said, don't call me a dev. Just call me a founder, right? I'm not sitting here with like 10 years of coding experience, et cetera, et cetera. I do my research and I try to like learn and be a sponge into the space. But salute to these guys that really are building something from a technical standpoint and i respect it so if this is actually facts about the team it gives me even more confidence on what's to come from the utility and the use case here all right so a lot of people are very bullish on this um utility right and um yeah yeah you know what i'm saying they, they'll they'll probably do well if they execute when you think about how big gaming and ai will be and you infuse those two together this is a super undervalued gem but again guys High risk, low market. These are all high risk, right? You know, so one of these projects probably you know, ain't going to be one of those ones, right? So I want you guys to understand, do your research. And even if you like this project, you could possibly even double down on your research and find something similar if you're not into this specific project, but you love the narrative behind it. So always weigh your options out as well as crypto, because um, in, 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 instead of chasing a green candle, you can always wait for that opportunity to come to you, right? There always will be another opportunity in crypto. All right, now moving on along, this right here is, is, is my favorite out of the whole group, right? Because this right here is giving me like AXGT vibes when I think about the team, right? $28 million market cap. We're going to talk about the utility. This is a little techie, guys. So you're going to have to really, really double down into this utility. The supply is only 850000 This is a scarcity AI token, right? Sitting here at... 33 bucks 25 million dollar market cap man um last time i checked it i think it went up it went up a little bit right so yeah, it's 26 million dollar market cap. this thing right here has the potential to be a absolute sender a absolute sender right when you think about the pumpamentals of this project right and outside of all the projects we just talked to it's peak bearish so it it's awarding you the best opportunity for an entry point because it's here building out its structure and floor. But why am I so bullish on Genius Token? And you know why it's down like this? Why? Well, we're going to talk about the team, right? The team here are these are are people that's actually known in Web two and had success, especially this guy Michael Hara, ex Nvidia VP. Is sitting here as an advisor for Genius AI. You can't get a more bullish team, right? Giving me that AXGT vibes, right? And we've seen what AXGT was able to do. But even more, Genius CEO Kenneth Hurley is an ex-Amazon senior software developer and ex-NVIDIA senior software. But these are a whole bunch of NVIDIA guys that came together and created a cryptocurrency project, right? He has produced dozens of AAA games such as Far Cry, Medal of Honor, Tiger Woods PGA. He has huge connections across the gaming and AI sector, right? Tech that is patented in the U.S. Genius AI is a licensed company in the U.S. They have Michael Hara, the ex-VP of Investor Relations of NVIDIA for 11 years as a main advisor. Guys, it's just crazy, right? So um, there was a little bit of FUD about this project. But I'm, I'm welcoming the FUD, right? Okay? Um, I, I'm not going to get actually into what actually the FUD was. But um, guys, just go do your research on this. I think that this project has potential just based off team, right? It's giving you those jazzy vibes, right? Um, but what actually is gen, gen, Genius AI, right? What, what they actually do? Because if you go into the like the website and stuff, it's, it gets a little techy. You know, you could tell by the team that it's going to get a little techy. I would recommend guys watching this video. This gives you a little understanding of what they're doing. Um, but I did uh, break it down, break it down a little bit for you. So Genius tokens are like special coins used to pay for and access advanced artificial intelligence AI services easily and affordable. Think of them as arcade tokens, but instead of using them to play video games, you use these AI genius tokens to do tasks like processing data or enhancing apps. They can be used across different blockchains. It's also multi-chain, which um, 
much like how a credit card at various stores which makes them very versatile for gamers and app developers these tokens are not just for buying services they can also be earned by playing games or using apps and then spent within those games or apps to buy special items or features this makes genius tokens both a tool for business and a fun part of gaming so it seems like they got some type of um things that they're they're doing within um gaming and um um iot right internet of things um utilizing unused cycles of compute devices like they got a lot that they're going that, that they're getting into right so you can see here it's going to be utilized for payments transactions data transfer um, validate and add complete um ai processing this is a entire ai hub guys entire ai hub now you would have you're gonna have to do a little bit more research right the cross-platform of power of Genius AI. The Genius AI system is truly cross-platform. It can be integrated into most devices. You can see that they're building an entire platform that could be integrated across the crypto space. So um, this one I think is going to do really well. Once, once people realize like who's behind this and what they're working to accomplish, because it gets a little techy, right? It gets a little techy. I think that they got a chance to, to do well in the future right utilizing unused cycles of compute devices on computers mobile devices and iot devices the system process artificial intelligence and machine learning data on end use device the end user is then paid in genius crypto tokens that can be you reused for in-app purchases or converted back to the currencies so yeah guys look at the right paper check it out go do your research and let me know what you think about that project last but not least we're going to talk about Tatsu. Now, Tatsu has been putting in a nice little correction as it pumped yesterday. $41 million market cap. They're building out an entire ecosystem um, for the Tao ecosystem. They're, they're building out an entire platform on the Tao ecosystem, aiming to be a Tao subnet, right? So the they, they have a, a utility, which is a Tao bot. I don't know what their, their, why their website is not working here. But the Tao bot, the Tao bot allows you to utilize the entire Tao ecosystem, Um just from their bot alone, you're starting to see a lot of different partnerships because people are seeing like, hey, if they got this bot that's allowing me to pretty much be a one-stop shop for the entire Tao ecosystem, let's strike a partnership and integration. You you know, this is giving me PAL AI vibes, right? So they're building a decentralized future on BitTensor. And um, yeah, I think that this project, when you think about the scarcity aspect, right? And this is just in comparison to Tao. Tau is, is one year old and listed on big exchanges like Binance and KuCoin. Current price 610 market for Billy. Supply 21 mil. All right, Tatsu is two month old. It's only listed on MEXC. The current price is 42 bucks. The market cap is 30 mil compared to um, 4 billion of Tau. And there's only 700K in circulation opposed to 6.5 mil. So even more scarcity. So we're talking about Tatsu hitting the price of 610 a lot more quicker than something of Tau because it has a lower amount of supply. So, again, you know, uh, a little bit more risk because we want to know more about the team, right? A lot of people are 50-50 with the utility and use case of Tau, but we're in it for some of the bags. And I think that these AI altcoins, if they deliver and execute, if they're actually building something that's real, you know, they have potential, right? And some of them do mark off the 100x um recipe right the perfect ingredients for a 100x guys let me know what you think about these ai projects let me know what your favorite narrative is these are some of the top low cap ai gems that i have been doing extensive research on let me know in the comments it's your boy crypto millie i'll see you in the next one